It's common to see special 5K running and walking events throughout the summer. However, last night in Bemidji was a first for the city. In this week's Community Spotlight, we highlight Light the Nation Blue. Under a blue sky, the red, white, and blue was showing their support for those who wear blue. Led by spouses of local law enforcement officers and support groups for those who serve, Bemidji held its first Light Up the Nation Blue event. Founded in 2011 out east by a member of law enforcement, the first Officers Down 5K was born. 650 people nationwide have registered for the 5K, but many more showed up at the event ready to walk, run, or bike from Paul Bunyan Park down to the Sanford Center and back, all in support of local law enforcement. Um, even though there's been so many tragedies lately, we just want them to know that, hey, our community is standing strong together and we support them. For what was only put together days ago, the outpouring of support and the amount of people that have shown up does not come to organizers as a surprise. Everybody seems to pull together when they need to and um, that's, that's why we love our community. For those who are not spouses of law enforcement, other members in the community have taken to social media to work and fundraise for projects that show support to our local police and sheriff's departments. Now was the time to step up and get the community behind them. Um, I've seen it statewide, but I didn't see anything locally here, so I figured, you know what, let's get something locally set up. Part of the mission for the Beltrami Blue Line supporters is helping make the silent majority not silent anymore, leading the way in vocalizing support for all who wear the badge. Society always amazes me when it comes to fundraising events. Um, so, and not just fundraising, but general outreach, especially something like this. Organizers for Light Up the Nation Blue 5K hope that people who are taking part in the event walk away with a sense of pride, knowing they are showing their support for local law enforcement. We just want to create a better awareness to, um, to support law enforcement. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.